My rituals now are necessary, more necessary than they've ever been in my life. Uh, because either I do these things that I don't want to do, or I will not be able to keep on painting. I have a plate that's already been placed on the table, and I get an apple, and I made sure there was a sharp knife there and a fork, and um, I get um, something like toast or uh, a biscuit or something for some carbohydrate, and um, that's it. I get myself over to the table once the tea is made. I put it on my walker and take it over and put it on the table with a cup, and uh, that is how I start my day. The first thing I do when I sit down is take up a knife and begin to peel the apple. And I always start at the stem end, and I peel off one round. I used to peel, to try to get the whole thing done, you know, without missing, and so that I'd have the whole peel, you know, so that I could, you know, pick it up and look at it. I don't even bother with that now. I just peel it carefully, a little bit at a time, so that I've got a whole pile of peels on the plate. Then I take this naked apple <laughs> and cut it into four, and um, then I take my fork and I eat the apple. And I do this the same way every day. I've kept a journal every day, well, almost every day, for years. It helps me figure myself out. It helps me remember things, too. I try to put everything important that happened the day before in the journal. I don't keep a day book. I don't keep a book by the telephone to write down everything, but I do try to remember the important things um, that have happened the day before. And then sometimes I just write a journal entry that is observation of the day. They vary. It depends on how I feel when I sit down. I usually write this after breakfast, and I don't let the day go by usually, unless I'm kind of fooled up for, one, for whatever reason, uh, go by without writing in the journal. My work has to be tied to rituals because my life is. My work simply has to be tied to the ritual of how I do, how I make my life. And sometimes that is very aggravating to other people. Um, I don't think I could ever live with another person again because I am so insistent on doing things my way, the way I want to, the time I want. I don't want people sitting around eating breakfast halfway through the morning. I want everything cleared up when I want it cleared up. I have no patience. I have run out of all of that, and I want to live life my way, and that's it. And that has to do with getting things done when I want them done. And so, yes, my work is tied to rituals.